Stroman cars. I clung to this world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. The Sith are weak. You were right to leave them. They are flawed, but they have their merits. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. Of course, Asina sends a lackey to greet us. And Lorman was a Sith lapdog when I met him, too. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. I never imagined I would be negotiating with someone like you. I only came to watch you beg for my help. You're speaking to the Empress of the Sith. You will address her with respect. I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. It may not be wise to split up. Be ready if anything happens. And keep an eye on Lorman. It's Minister Lorman! Minister Lorman! Is that so hard to remember? Don't worry about us, Commander. There remain Sith who do not approve of the Alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. I was strong enough to take Arkin down without your help. And then his sister took his place. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. And then you'll betray me and claim it for yourself. Ambition was the downfall of many great Sith. I will not let it be mine. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. Engine's non-responsive. We need to bring it down. We're coming in too fast. Bail out! Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. Give me one reason I shouldn't kill you here and now. We both nearly died in that crash. I wouldn't put myself in such danger. My vessel was sabotaged. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. If I find out you arranged this... I'm aware of the consequences, and I promise you I am not behind it. But I am eager to learn who is. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming. Forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. 
Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. Slogging through the forest to hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. You're going to pay for your employer's mistake. Good luck. The Geno Herodon don't go down easy. The Geno Herodon? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. The beacon destroyed, comm signals still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. We haven't destroyed the last of our enemies. I assume the Geno Haridan have a camp nearby. That should be our destination. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. It won't be once we're done. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners, not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what she started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. I suppose the shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh. That Republic snake. Someone I should be familiar with? Suresh is the former Chancellor of the Republic. But intelligence believes she hasn't given up her power entirely. Into the temple! I'm sure there's another way out. I'll blast my way out if it means escaping this bone pit. You and I both, Commander. Shall we get moving? Reports from Drome and Kaas claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. 
The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious outlander is missing. Odessan is not the target. Sith Lord. I once thought these ancient temples held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. The search for immortality is a dangerous one. Only to those limited by their own flesh. I have transcended. Emperor of the Sith was my first face. But it is merely one of many I have worn. And now you wear no face at all. You're trapped. My fate is tied to yours because I choose it. No one can command the Eternal Empire but you. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. Baywan, now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here to Odessan. Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the Alliance can last. There are rumors about the Commander. Remind them where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. Minister Lawman warned us you might sneak off. Don't you know it's rude to make me come out in a storm like this? We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. So you traded groveling to Asina for groveling to Suresh. You're pathetic, Lorman. It's Minister Lorman, and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. You'll die the same as her. You should have surrendered, Lorman. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finished the job. Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage! Anything happens to me and they're dead! This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Oh, hello, Lawman. This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. You started the killing without me. We can't let you have all the fun. It's good to hear your voice. I knew you weren't dead. Never doubted it for a second. Suresh tried to kill me. It's time to repay the favor. Promise you'll let me watch? Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. 
Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? I say we kill him together. I fully agree. Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. There are dark times ahead, but fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. I assume you know everything, then. I'll take that as a yes. It doesn't matter. The Alliance needs a leader like me. I saw an opportunity and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. What do we do with her? Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. And it's exactly what you deserve. Is it wrong to say I enjoyed that? Empress Asina is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the war room. I apologize for everything on Dromon Cuts. But I still believe we should unite your people with mine. I can't take that risk, Asina. The Alliance moves forward alone. I understand. I hope we never find ourselves on opposite ends of the battlefield. Not that I'm complaining, but why did you refuse her? The Sith Empire's broken. They're too weak to be of any value. I only hope we don't come to regret this. In times like these, we need all the allies we can get. Mayday! Mayday! This is the cargo freighter, Radala! Does anybody copy? This is Koth Bortena aboard the Gravestone. We got your back, Radala. You okay? We've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Radala. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Koth. Looking forward to meeting you in person. <laughs>